a lot of the foods that we see here are the true Pennsylvania Dutch foods, not always known for being the healthiest, a lot of fried foods. So if you are coming, you know, have a lighter meal before you come. You don't want to have too much fried food, you know, you know that's going to be higher in fat. Um, and like I said, some of the pickled items are going to be higher in, in salt. So you can kind of use the general rules and try to stay with the healthier foods. People don't really take the time to uh, make fresh food like this and, and nobody wants the fried foods anymore either. So this is all fried, fried, fried. Which is a treat. And it's delicious. So. <laughs> They had a lot of good meat entree options, like you could get the ox on the sandwich. Um, the one stand had the larger meal and you could get chicken with that or roast beef. Uh, those would be better options than doing something like the hot dogs and some of the other fried foods. Yeah, it does help that you're walking around and, and eating at the same time, so it helps a little bit. You're burning some calories off. Uh -huh. Our, our culture, it's just all food based. They want to try the shoe fly pie, they want to try the funnel cake or whatever else is around. If you want to have a funnel cake, don't eat the whole thing, share it with somebody. Some of the desserts are maybe something that somebody would want to have, um, but again, you may not have them all the time, so it's okay to have something like that, but as long as you limit it, you can make it fit.